everybody, it's Jim Colucci, author of Golden Girls Forever. And in Golden Girls Forever, in the ebook version actually, I talk about this upcoming restaurant space coming to New York City. We're here at 187th and Broadway for Rue La Rue, which is a cafe that is Rue McClanahan themed and Golden Girls themed. So I'm here with. Hey, I'm Michael LaRue. I was Rue's uh, gay best friend at the time of her death, and I'm opening this cafe with her son, Mark Fish. So, it together. and I'm so excited for all the stuff that's going to be here, because if you look, first of all, hello, I'm standing with Rue McClanahan's in, and Rue holding her at me. <laughs> so, it's amazing. There's so much memorabilia that's going into this cafe. I mean, look here, this is Blanche's mauve heel for, that she wore in the pilot, and I believe you said she wore this one in season five. These are rhinestones. Rhinestone Lucite yeah, mules. Mules from season five. From season yeah, five. Now they're in a different box. And uh, I know the, uh, about the artwork. You were telling us about oh, yeah, the artwork. Rue, Rue used to do these things she called doodles. And so we've gone through our art collection. We're picking a lot of them with pithy sayings and things that were important to her, her mantras. I'm trying to give sort of a cross section of Rue as an artist, both the television work, but then also um, drawing she did. She did a lot of. Um, Flousing, she called it, where she would glue things onto stuff. And also, I'm pulling pieces from throughout her career. It's not only the Golden Girls, you know, Jim, although that was wonderful. This is a piece that B. Arthur had made for her when they worked together on Maud, because remember, wow. B. and Rue worked together for 14 years. And I've never seen, of course, that before. But you were telling me about what the star means. What well, yeah, the, the star was Rue's good luck talisman. If you look at the Golden Girls episodes closely, you'll see this thin gold necklace that Rue wore in every episode. It's got a little star on it. And so a lot of her furniture has the star carved into it. And a lot of people who loved her, when they would have gifts made for her, they would put that good luck talisman in. I love it. Now, uh, in addition to, and I want to get to some of the clothes in a minute, but in addition to some of the stuff that's going to be on display, and you said it's going to be a rotating display, so you come often because there's going to yeah. be new Rue. There's so much well, yeah, you said you have. Because yeah. how much stuff do you have? Well, Rue, Rue is a collector. That's what you call someone who has enough closet space to hide everything in. She's actually a hoarder. I mean, we found <laughs> notes that she passed to her girlfriends in grade school. She said, Oh my thing. God. This is her prom dress from 1949. Now, I wrote about that in the book, but I've never seen it in person. Look at that. Yeah, it's a great piece. It fits me, but I have to suck it in. <laughs> but you said you found that in a shed in her Manhattan backyard? Yeah, she had six storage areas out in her backyard. Um, and this was in a plastic bag. It was airtight, one of those ones you suck the air yeah. out with a vacuum. And when we cut it, it started growing. And then all day long, it got bigger and bigger until it was six feet across. Because Rue was the only one of the four women who kept all her Golden Girls clothes. Well, back. yeah, she has the Golden Girls costumes, too. We have a lot of those. This one right here, this was from the final episode. She wore that in the last episode of the Golden Girls. But these pieces, the, these were the pieces that were made by Judy Evans, the costume designer. Yeah. And these are works of art. Some of these robes are just... Now look at that, and that's Treasures. painted silk. Yeah. So well, I love this one, if you don't mind me pulling which one? it off. Oh, yeah, this, this one. one because here. I remember right. so many episodes. I remember her like coming to the kitchen uh, eating cheesecake and dressed in this beautiful in this beautiful dressing gown. So because we have so many different pieces, though, we are going to rotate. Yeah, um, every few months, we're going to just change out the mannequins and change out all of the vitrines and put in different items so that people can keep coming back and seeing stuff. I love it. And, you know, also, things from that are just from Rue's life. I mean, even pieces of furniture. These are chairs from Rue's home, yes. correct? That's a lamp from Rue's home. Yes. So uh, uh, there are furnishings all throughout uh, the cafe that are actually from Rue's real life. The, we, I just, we just took a picture that I'll post later that we're standing in front of a, a, a wooden bookcase that's going to become, you said, the sugar and creamer station. Yeah. And that's from her <laughs> California house. And that has the stars carved into it, too, her good luck. Her good luck logo. The enough. other thing I, I think is great is that you're going to have merchandise that is original to the cafe. Yes. So in addition to t-shirts and all kinds of things, you can get Golden Girls flavored coffee. This is the Rue flavor, right? The, yes, the Blanche. Rue, Rue's the spicy one. The Blanche is the spicy, but then we have a breakfast blend that's very mild. That's the Rose. We have the Italian roast, which of course is the Sophia. And then we have the Everyday Grind, which is the Dorothy. We also did some um, pint glasses. Oh my god, I love that. These are um, for the beers. Oh, and by the way, we have a Golden Girls Ale and a Rusty Anchor Lager. Oh my end. god. But um, Golden Girls on one side and then the Rue La Rue Cafe on the other. Fans are going to go crazy collecting that. Uh, yes, you, well, as you are. said, you think they're going to steal them. Yes, but I hope they, they buy I them. Steal them. <laughs> but I ordered 400 of them just to be safe. <laughs> 
I love that. This is so amazing. There's so much. I mean, this is like, I mean, it is what you intended. It's a room museum. And we're just in one Absolutely. room right now, the room yeah. museum. There's more construction going on above our heads where yeah. you're building a huge section of the cafe. So it's, it's oh my god, I, and what you told me, the stuff that's going to go in there. So many treasures. I mean, you'll come here and you'll encounter earrings you recognize from a Golden Girls episode. Sure. It's just, it's amazing. Sure. And also just the things that you save. You know, um, we have notes that the women would send each other at Christmas time. We have Polaroids from behind the scenes. And you know, these are things that should not be sitting in a box in a storage area somewhere. They should be on view, and so that's what we're going to do here. Oh my god, it's so amazing. I can't wait. You know, uh, we're here in late September. Here I am in New York. I'm going back to LA for a while, but it looks like my next trip to New York may coincide with your opening, correct? Because you're opening in the fall. You have any any yeah. update for like what? No. Ish, fall ish, right? Um, Whenever you're ready. Well, the workmen have turned into artists, and I don't yeah. want to pressure them. I don't yes. want to take an arbitrary date and then have them rush. So I'm just letting it organically okay, develop, and we will open when everything. Sometime ready. this fall, we will all be here drinking Golden Girls coffee, eating and cheesecake, eating cheesecake, and watching episodes. We're putting a big TV up on the wall so we can all watch Golden Girls episodes together. And I mean, some fun things. You'll know this place from the outside because you will see uh, the awning. Which will have the Nicolosi, that famous portrait, famous that portrait Richard of Rue. Nicolosi did, yeah. There will be, in, and I guess in, in warm weather, there will be uh, cafe umbrellas with the Golden Girls images. Indeed. And I, you showed me, it's, not, it's outside in the warehouse, but you showed me, and I'll post the picture later, uh, a Rue McClanahan star that's a Hollywood Walk of Fame type star that will be right at the threshold to this cafe. Correct? Yes, that's what you'll walk over to get inside. You'll walk over Rue star. So there, it's like, it's really, the details are amazing, and I can't wait for more. So. Golden Girls Forever, I put in a plug for my own book, and I will be at the Golden Girls Puppet Show tonight, that's September 27th, in New York City, doing a Q&A after the show, but then this fall we'll all be here at Rue LaRue. Well, I hope so. Come say hello. I'm Michael LaRue, and I look forward to meeting you. Thanks, everybody. Oh, and that's, and that's of course, Men Love My Cupcakes. <laughs>